Hi everyone, Vladimir is here with his best tracksuit and Coldwell Games monthly report, October 2022. Income. Income has been lower than expenses, I'd say much lower, but uh, mostly because we have paid royalties to everyone who worked on our games and uh, I think this is the way how I want it to be. Crown of Pain. Crown of Pain has received Halloween content update, two new heroes, 20 new levels and new quality of life changes are waiting to be checked out. Uh, I just realized that I'm talking like a advertisement person, but uh, yeah, um, I think it was a very welcome update. It's becoming clear that similar to combat rework that we've done before, which in my opinion has greatly improved the game. Uh, we'd need to work on the balancing and focus on it, and uh, we are yet to discuss how to do it properly with Yanis, but uh, I'm glad to see the game shaping up, and uh, wow, I hope you check it out eventually. We have run the second playtest of Stories from the Outbreak, and it has somewhat showed the mixed results. With aesthetics feeling spot on, I still feel that we need to do more gameplay adjustments, and... Uh, there's definitely going to be a third playtest eventually. We are also starting to focus more on the story element of the whole thing. We are literally going to have a narrative design meeting today. Wow, who would have thought? Um, so, a lot of changes ahead, but a lot of core parts are done, so this brings me joy. We are gradually working on a small update for Lazy Galaxy 2. This is ghostly, mostly going to be related to quality of life changes, and uh, there also might be a new track. Apart from that, this is all for now. I hope you have a good November ahead of you, and uh, Vladimir is out. Bye.